Hey guys, how's it going? It's the Haggard Nerd here playing Astroneer. This episode, we found, or excuse me, last episode, we found something out in the distance that looks like it might be interesting. So uh, we're going to go take a trip and try to find that and hopefully find some pretty awesome research. Hopefully, but we shall see. All right, so I am back at the base. I made some tethers off camera. And I think we are ready to make the expedition. So let's head out. So at the end of last episode, I climbed up on the side of this mountain out here a little bit, just to see kind of what was out there. Ooh, it's very bright over here. Very bright. Making sure there wasn't a storm around. I was worried the dust or something might... I was worried that the brightness was because of dust that might be from a storm, but I was not correct, thankfully. Alright, so tethers, tethers, tethers. Okay, time for tethers. Alliteration. Totally time for tethers. Today. I think I see it. And I'm out of... Nope, I'm not. I'm just not pushing it right. Tedious tethers today. <laughs> Alright, I'm done. Alright, so, ooh, I got some stuff here, got some stuff there, ooh, careful, don't dig down, life lessons, don't dig down. Alright, I hear wind, I see, no, I don't see anything, okay, I'm being paranoid, I just really don't want to get caught out here. In a storm. Okay, so we got some minerals. That's good. But more importantly, we have two things of research. And this is kind of a long haul back. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a cut. Uh, or actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take both of these back to the base. I have to take them back one at a time. So from here, I'm going to cut to where I've taken both of these back to the base. All right, we're getting back to the base finally. And with the magic of editing, you didn't have to sit through all that. <laughs> all right, so let's see what we got here. I'm hoping. Come on, good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. Ooh. Condenser. Okay, I have no idea what that does, but we'll find out. And it is... Oh. Daylight. <laughs> so now it's charging. I see that it's pulling power from over here too. I think that is because of the solar panels. And here's a point where I'm wondering if I tossed... Well, I mean, you would think it would be using that power already if it was going to. See, other than putting it on your backpack, I don't see the point of... These blocks, they don't quite work like I thought they would, but that's not a fault of the developers or the game. What is that? Coal. Interesting, okay. Coal. What can I do with coal? I wonder if I can make torches if I can find some sticks. Oh wait, wrong game. <laughs> okay, that'll just go down in our pile. Oh crap. Okay, so we're, 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 what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? 
Okay, so there's no power going to this right now. That requires aluminum. I still don't think we have any aluminum. But I'm going to make a solar panel for this guy. There we go. Does that help at all? I think it does. Okay, so, ooh, a solar panel compound. Uh, I think we might be able to do that. Here's some compound. This is starting to get kind of bad. Starting to get kind of bad. I think I'm gonna have to start organizing my junk, my junk hole. Okay, really need a solar panel. This power has always been an issue up to this point. Uh oh. I know that sound. And it looks like it's coming right for us. So I'm gonna leave that there and I'm going to hang out in the pot. It might be going just to the side of us, we might be okay. I don't know. Oop, nope, okay, danger. Hopefully my junk pile will be fine. kind of sit here and hope nothing bad happens. Alright, are we done? Yes! Okay, we're done. Alright, now we can put our newly found solar panel to use, and I think I know exactly what I'm going to do with it. I'm going to put it right where it's not going to fit. <laughs> All right, so we'll put it here at least and see if it can feed anything else. So solar panel, storage, yes. Wind turbine, aluminum, lithium for a big old battery. Ooh, okay. A generator, a big generator. Okay. Ooh, a seat. Okay, so it looks like a lot of this stuff is stuff that I can make on my backpack, only larger versions and some additional things. Another thing I'd like to do is try to make a vehicle assembly area, but I don't know, I don't recall exactly what I need for that. Let's see, a resin. Okay, two rhythm. Um, am I full? Yes, that seems to be the case. Okay, one second. I don't really need the beacon because I'm not out and I have enough beacons. There we go. Printer, fuel condenser, ooh, okay. Research, smelter, vehicle bay, we need aluminum. I need to find aluminum. That is the one thing that I don't think I've found that I could really use. I do kind of want to organize this a bit. Um, hmm, another junk place. Okay, let's put our random elements over here, and we will put 
power and oxygen and other of those types and organics over in here. I swear, once we get that storage area, I will make this a lot more organized because this is very <laughs> kind of crappy feeling. Let's just throw stuff in a hole. Um, I think I can also put this over here. More rare stuff can go over here, I guess. Lithium. Lithium. So this is for compound and resin. That's going to be for kind of rare stuff. And then that's going to be for other. <laughs> I'm going to call it other. Alright. Cool. So that's organized. Aluminum. Okay, so I am going to go ahead and call an episode here. Uh, what I want to do is I want to take a few minutes to see where the best place to find some aluminum is and then come back and then go find some aluminum. If you didn't guess that already. So anyway, <laughs> as always guys, thanks for watching. Catch you in the next episode. Take it easy.